Conrad here at St Kilda. Are uh, you enjoying your time in Melbourne? Yeah, certainly. It's um, a bit different. We don't normally uh, stay over for the whole week, but uh, had, had the game in Sydney last week um, on the weekend, so decided to come here and spend a week, and I think the boys are enjoying it, loving, loving the city anyway. And what do you think of Linden House Centre, these facilities? Uh, yeah, the boys have uh, been very impressed, um, a little bit jealous to be honest. It's uh, a lot better than anything um, we have back home, but um, we're already taking photos and trying to send them back to our CEO, so uh, hoping we could get something similar. Um, it, it makes a big difference, you know, uh, if, we, if you can have a facility like this and something all in one where you spend your whole day. Um, but uh, it's obviously where AFL has gone to, been professional for a, for a lot longer, and so hopefully uh, rugby will catch up and sometime soon. What's the itinerary today? What's the process about the training? And you're here for the whole day, obviously. Yeah, and that's obviously why it's, it's been good to, to use the facilities here. We uh, normally, it's sort of our normal day two or, or a Tuesday. Um, we'll sort of gym and a few skills on the field in the morning, and then um, we'll have our proper team session um, in the afternoon, by which stage hopefully the boys have recovered from the from the game on, on Saturday night, and uh, you know we can rip into a few things. Big game against the Rebels this weekend. Uh, what are you looking forward to most about playing at Amy Park again? Um, yeah, we've got a you know bit of revenge for for last time. I think you know we played here uh, when I was involved. I think that's three years ago now. But um, yeah, we got up to a healthy lead and then watched it whittle away, and, and they won pretty easily in the end. So, and I think it might have been their first win over a New Zealand team or something. So it was it was tough to take. But uh, they're a side that's playing really well now. I think in the three years you know since uh, we played them last, they're now um, really respected around the league, and they've got, had some good results uh, already this year. So it, it'll be a tough battle, and you know it's important for us sort of getting to this stage of the competition, and um, we're just you know obviously keen for a win, but. No, it won't come easy. Do you consider yourself and do the boys consider themselves St Kilda supporters now that they've trained here? <laughs> oh, absolutely. Um, yeah, it's funny, the, the rise of uh, Aussie rules, it's starting to get a, a lot more recognition back in New Zealand, and obviously with St Kilda playing a, a home game effectively in Wellington, so you know that's starting to build a bit of support, and I know, I know a few of us were there watching the game. Um, so yeah, you have uh, certainly building a bit of support in the capital back home. What do you think of the sport itself? Uh, I, I love it. It's... Uh, I, I've I you know, managed to watch a few games over the last few years and I, I love it live. I think there's something about you sort of understand the way it's going on a lot more live and uh, a few guys still struggle to understand the rules and, and all that but uh, some, some of them just think it's a big game of scrag but uh, yeah, I like it and, uh, and like I say it is, it is building popularity uh, back in New Zealand as well. Great to have you at the Saints today. Oh, it's been a pleasure.